Hey everyone, how you doing? David Saad here from Sky Gems. Hope you're having a great day so far. Thank you so much for joining me and for checking out this absolutely stunning 27.65 carat amethyst. There, uh, there's more full details available on the site. There's a link in the description of that. You can also check out all of our other offerings. Some really lovely amethyst, ametrine, citrine, and everything else there. So this, let me get back to this gem here. So this is a uh, Bolivian amethyst, absolutely stunning. It's from the Anahi mine, uh, which is where all the ametrine uh, that's on the market comes from. So what's special about uh, Bolivian amethyst is that it uh, there's a higher iron content, and that gives you this wonderful red flash. Right. So as I move it, you see through there. There's this wonderful red flash that you get from the stone. Absolutely stunning. This gem has lovely, lovely color and saturation to it. Uh, funny thing about the saturation of, of gems, so and amethyst in particular. Um, so amethyst has been a gem since uh, I mean before, like before the written word. There have been archaeological finds that have found amethyst that was used as jewelry from you know dating back pre you know pre-agriculture like more than 10,000 years um, so there's no written word no nothing and, and people were using this gem as a uh, as a gemstone as a decorative gemstone and uh, what's interesting is that um, people believed that uh, amethyst worn as a pendant when you were drinking would keep you you know clear of mind and their thought and keep you from getting drunk and they believed this uh, partly because they believed that the amethyst would get uh, brighter and uh, more saturated as they drank well here's the thing they did uh, but not because the amethyst changed because your eyes changed when you consume alcohol your pupils dilate so colors seem brighter they seem more saturated they seem richer and um, that's the effect that people were having, uh, that, 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 that was happening to, to people. And that's why, you know, that's why they thought that the stones were, you know, looked darker. Well, they did look darker, right? And they did look more saturated. So I've always, you know, thought that was kind of a fun thing. So there's actually a trick that some diamond dealers will do that when they're buying they will have a, a half a shot of whiskey. I mean, usually anybody I've known that actually does it, it's whiskey. And I, any alcohol would do. But um, And that will open their pupils a little bit and actually allow them to see the off colors of diamonds a little bit better. Right? So that's um, yeah, diamond buying trick. So I would imagine that if you go into the jewelry store and ask them if they have whiskey for you know you to look at diamonds, they would probably not, um, yeah, they'd probably just not have the whiskey and they might look at you like you have two heads. So anyway, this video is getting a little bit long. This is a stunning stone. If you have any other questions, please let me know and I hope you have yourself a great day. Thanks. Bye.